Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365 and Ari Aster's follow-up to Hereditary Midsummer is coming to Blu-ray, so here's what you need to know. channel please hit the like button subscribe hit that bell notification and put up videos every single day you can also find me over twitter and instagram at movie guy 365 as well as the disney magic hour podcast i will leave a link for that in the description okay midsummer ari aster's film right after hereditary uh released in theaters uh, just a few short months ago is getting a october 1st release date that release date is starting to get really crowded uh not anywhere near what we're getting in september 10th but it's starting to look pretty heavy if you're a 4k collector Unfortunately, this one is going to be a Blu-ray release only. There will be a 4K digital copy available on iTunes and Voodoo, I believe. Um, look, I'm a big fan of the film. I really enjoyed it, but I'm gonna do something I normally don't do. I'm gonna recommend you hold off on this release. Now, listen to explain why. If you're a 4K fan, you're obviously a little upset because we're not getting 4K. This would look amazing with HDR or Dolby Vision. I think it would look great. And it just struck me as very odd that they chose to go with Blu-ray only. Now, yes, there's a possibility they could do a, a 4K release down the road, but I think there's something a little bit more than that. Now, recently they screened the Ari Aster director's cut version of the film. Now, the movie was additional, I believe, uh, at least 35, 40 minutes longer. And it, it, from what I've read review-wise, it seemed to be a more all-encompassing cut. So from my perspective, I believe we are going to be getting a 4K disc release and it's going to be this extended cut at some point in the future. I don't think it's going to happen with the release of the theatrical version, which is due on October 1st, but I think we are going to be getting it. And I think for that reason alone, I would hold off on the release personally, unless you just want the, the, the standard Blu-ray, you don't care about uh, director's cuts, extended versions, or anything like that, you just want the movie, then that will be available for you at the beginning of October. There are no retail exclusive editions that I'm aware of. As I mentioned, if you want the 4K digital copy of the theatrical cut, you will be able to get that on iTunes and Vudu. So, I, you know, normally I'm, I'm like, go buy, 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 uh, you know, as far as that goes. But I think in this case, I'm, I'm gonna go with my gut feeling on this, and I'm just gonna hold off for the time being. But, I love the movie. I think it definitely should be seen. And you know, if you choose to see it at home and didn't see it in the theater, you it, it's you know it's interesting film. And I really think it needs to be seen at, at by pretty much everybody. It's just one of those movies. So yeah, go ahead. Let me know in the comments below what you plan to do. Are you going to pick up the the Blu-ray standard, or are you going to be like me and wait for the extended cut, possibly a 4K physical release? All right, let me know. And in the meantime, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. I put out videos every single day. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.